Hey YouTube, StoveMods is back with a little update for the Hobo Toaster. In the previous video, I, I introduced this as the Hobo Toaster. And by the way, I, I didn't test it on this favorite stove of mine because I said I would have to drill holes and I don't want it. But I overlooked that I could do that. But anyway, the problem with this version was that um, the bread got burned a little bit in the middle because it was leaning against the stove here. Um, it wasn't that bad but I was just trying to improve that and this is what I came up with. So this is pretty much the same construction but it's ha it has this part just to create a gap between the bread and the stove so it can't get burned. Of course it will take a little bit longer to um, heat up the bread and, and I'm not sure if this distance is perfect. I didn't test it yet and you could probably tweak this forever. By the way, I didn't take any measurements of that also when building it but as you can see it is very even. I figured out how to have this and this and this and this at the same length and also on the other side and what I did was just I took those pliers and bended it at a right angle with those. I did that here and here and here and here and so the length is just the width of the pliers. Also, as you can see, it is quite a lot bigger than this part. So if it's really about space, maybe you would still use that. That works even those that are made in the first place and never tested um, do work. So, um, but they're not that stable. I wouldn't recommend them, but they're probably better than nothing. I'm not gonna do a test on that today, but I will soon, but I want to do that on a new stove because I will make a new version of this favorite stove of mine. Even there's space for improvement, like always, and I hope I can present that to you soon. Until next time, bye.